Vegas squad. How is everyone doing today? And welcome back to another vlog. Yes, I'm finally back on CB12 vlogs. I'm not sure for how long, but I'm going to keep doing these vlogs as long as I can. And I haven't vlogged in two months. Last vlog I had done was in February and it was the grocery haul. Superstore grocery haul. It was a massive grocery haul, I think. I think it was a massive grocery haul, but it was the last one that I had done. Today, April 20th, I thought let's get back onto CB12 vlogs and start filming. And the first vlog back, I kind of wanted to do something that I've been doing for years. And it's a sample source box unboxing, which I've already unboxed the sample source box itself. And if you guys haven't yet seen what I got in it, go to my Instagram. I had posted a picture of all the things that I got, which a lot of you guys really enjoyed and I'm enjoying. We got it right here. And I thought let's go through this together and maybe try some of the things in here. If you guys are following me on Instagram or if you guys haven't yet followed me on Instagram but you guys are following me on here, this is the first time you'll see them. So let's get some of the things I got in here. I get a lot of coupons in these boxes every year, which is really good because I like trying new things, especially if I can try them before buying them. And if I like it, you know, I'll buy some more. But if I don't, then at least I tried it. So I think their motto is try it before buying it. There's quite a few snacks that we could try, which is good because I like trying snacks. Do you guys like trying snacks? This is the box itself. And a lot of people ask me, how do I get Sample Source? It's simple and easy. All you got to do is register on samplesource.com. I'll leave the information in the top of the description. Offering the Sample Source boxes, the free samples for fall and spring. So this one is the spring. I didn't get one in the fall because they changed the whole how to get it before you were able to just get through your email, a survey, and they would give you samples based on your answers of your survey. Now it's all about invites. So you have to be invited to get these samples. And the fall, I didn't get invited. I'm really glad that I was chosen this time. I'm always greatly appreciated for sample source and everything that they do for people to try some samples before buying it. So I'm super grateful. The thing we got is, it's funny because I got a coupon the last time I had gotten sample source and I didn't get the chance to use it because by the time I actually found these in stores, the coupon expired. So, and these are hard to find. I know they're available at Sobeys. Uh, if I did get a coupon, I'm definitely going to go back and get some. So let's try these. A pair of scissors, cause I needed some scissors to open these. These are kind of hard to open. Okay, so these are nothing but Monterey Jack. And they're with red bell pepper and jalapeno. So they're almost like, like cheese puffs. Okay, they have a weird smell to them. <laughs> like They kind of remind me of like puffs, so cheers. I'll tell you this right now, these aren't for me. 100% cheese with a crunch. They're not bad, but they're just not for me. Just have kind of strange taste to them. It's not for me. I'm going to keep them because I might be able to put these in like a salad or something to add a nice little crunch. kind of looks like croutons almost. Not for me, but we'll find some use for this. I would give these a two out of five. Like, they're not for me. I'm going to try a Rice crispy. Uh... I think these are like their new home style original. Kind of look like it's just a regular Rice Krispie, maybe a little thicker. Yeah, maybe a little thicker, maybe. I love Rice Krispie, especially the Kellogg's. Oh yeah, these look a lot better than their original ones. <sighs> Cheers. Way better. Five out of five. <laughs> definitely getting more of those <laughs> next thing we got it's not a snack but they're reacting some allergy medicine and it's good that i got these this year my allergies have been really bad like i've been flaring out with these allergies um constantly pretty much every day I've been taking 
like allergy medicine practically every day. So I am so glad I got the chance to try reacting, even though I have tried it before. So I'm glad that I got some more. I got two boxes. So thank you very much, Sample Source. You guys are truly amazing. You kind of sense that I had allergies, right? Nerds gummy clusters. And we got some, I'm not even sure if I'm pronouncing it right, but trolleys or trolleys. But I got some of the candies, so we'll try these. I don't think I've ever tried trolleys. I've tried Nerds uh, clusters, and I had reviewed it on CB12 Reviews, so if you guys want to check that out. Oh, here's the trolleys, and I'm assuming these are like gummy worms. Sour Bright Crawlers Minis. Yeah, they were good. Not sour, sour. More sweet than sour, but these are really good. I would give these a... I would give these a 4 out of 5. These are really good. And these I've already tried. And these are good. I do like the nerds. The nerd clusters. Yeah. They kind of look like gummies. One thing I did grow up on. Monitored. Well, I would give the nerds a four out of five as well. Just like the trolleys. I think I got some coupons for the nerds. Yep. And got a dollar coupon. And I think I got a coupon for the... Nope, we didn't get for the trolleys. Oh, yep. The trolleys. Yep. We got a dollar coupon as well. So these are going to definitely going to come in handy. And I can't wait to get like a bag of these trolleys because these are good. Another thing we got is this OxyClean, like, stain remover. I never used OxyClean. I've heard about it, and a lot of people were always telling me um, for stains, especially some heavy stains. The next sample I got is, I am super excited for this one, because I've had a whole bunch of flavors of these bars, but I've never had this one. So this is the Kind Snack Bar. And I call them like a protein bar because they're full of protein. They're like the nuts and some dark chocolate. This one's a nut and sea salt and dark chocolate. So this one, I am super excited. I'm stoked to try this. And I'm definitely going to use the coupon they gave me. Tell me, that does not look good. Like, I think I'd much rather have this after dinner than your traditional chocolate bar, right? Like, you guys agree? Cheers. This is really good. A little salty, a little sweet, a little salty. The chocolate works great. A little crunchy from those peanuts or those nuts. And there's like almonds, peanuts. And that's all I see, almonds and, and peanuts. But super crunchy from those nuts. The chocolate, not overly sweet, but the hint of sea salt. The salt kind of brings out the flavor of chocolate even more. This would get a five out of five from me to you all day. Now I have the mini Canada Dry. This is the zero sugar. Yeah, zero sugar ginger ale. And people are telling me that this tastes exactly like regular ginger ale without the added sugar. With the diet, you definitely taste like it's diet, but not like this one. I guess apparently this one, the best. So I can't wait to try it. So it is super cold. So, cheers. Yeah, actually, this is good. Definitely has, like, more of a ginger ale taste, like a regular ginger ale, not diet. It has zero sugar and everything. So, what is the sweetened with? It's surprising. This is really good. I don't drink ginger ale that often. If I do, it's more like when I'm sick, but I would choose this over the regular ginger ale any day. The flavor is spot on like regular without the added sugar, which is a bonus for me because I don't really like a lot of like, I think as you get older, you kind of mainly try to stay away from the uh, full calorie drinks and you'd rather stick to the just the zero sugar, zero calorie drinks like ginger ale or Diet Pepsi, Diet Coke. I'd rather that over the regular Pepsi, Coke, and ginger ale. 
the zero sugars are perfect because now I'm definitely going to go get myself a case. Yeah, I'm really liking this. This is really good. Every time you get a sample source box, you get coupons. So I did tell you guys that I did get the nerds and the trolleys. So these are definitely gonna come in handy. Probably gonna see if I can find them at Food Basics. A lot of products that I get from sample source, it's hard to find, especially in Chatham, but we'll find it. There is a new iced tea. Like if you, I'm not sure if you guys like the Pure Life or not Pure Life, but Pure Leaf, but there is a new flavor. It's a blackberry real brewed iced tea and a taste of the real fruit flavor. But I do find it and mainly these drinks, I'm able to find them at shoppers. So that's the first place I'm going to try and find. I'm going to see if I can find it. And when I do, stay tuned for CB12 reviews. If you guys haven't yet subscribed to CB12 reviews yet, do so right now because that's where I'm gonna be uploading that review. And if you guys have tried this this tea, yes, iced tea, let me know what you guys all thought about it. I did get a coupon for Bissell. Don't like buying Bissell because I find it to be expensive. Like it has to be on sale or if I get a coupon because I don't buy Bissell unless it's on sale or I get a coupon because it's expensive and it just tastes the same as any other margarine there is out there. And I like the no name margarine. I just find the no name margarine to taste the same thing as this. I don't eat a lot of margarine. So there is no need to, for me to buy expensive margarine if I don't need to. But I do like Bissell. Don't get me wrong because they do have amazing margarine. Uh, there is one that I kind of want to check out. It's the Bissell olive oil. And I do use the Bissell oils if it's on sale. <laughs> I like buying things that are on sale. It's just, that's just me. I love buying things that are on sale, but I got a coupon for free, for a free Bissell. So I'm definitely going to get one of these. There is a vegan one, an olive oil one, an original one, or a salted Bissell. I'm not sure if it's, yeah, plant-based soft Bissell. So which one should I get? When I do get a, one of these, which one should I get? Let me know in the comment section below, because I want to know from you guys, which one is the best? Because I want to hear from what you guys have maybe have, have experienced or if you guys have tried them before. I like to know these things from you guys. I also got a coupon for a nothing but. Uh, there is other flavors. So I might have not liked this one. But there is other flavors. So I'm definitely going to check out the cheddar one. Because that sounds really good. I love cheddar cheese. So the orange one. I'm definitely going to try that one. The Monterey Jack, I just didn't like it. I just don't like Monterey Jack cheese. I prefer cheddar. I love cheddar. Yes, I do like cheddar cheese. I like my cheddar cheese on my burgers. <laughs> so I think the cheddar cheese would be good. And when I do get these, I'm going to try them in the vlog because I want to let you guys know. I did get a coupon for some dishwasher or no. Is it dishwasher? No, it's... Okay, so it's this is washing machine um was it cleaners i've never heard of this one and i mean we do constantly wash our washing machine sometimes like uh when we do a lot of loads of laundry uh, sometimes it's good to clean your washer from what i've read so we've been doing a lot of cleaning of our washers so i'm definitely going to keep an out a uh, close eye out on for the washing cleaners because I'm definitely going to try it. Okay, I did get an... Oh, I, I got two of the coupons for a... The Pear Leaf. I got two of them. So I'm going to try the Blackberry. And I might try the Blackberry. And then maybe if I like it, I'll use the other coupon. Or maybe I can try a different flavor. Let me know if you guys have tried any of these flavors of iced tea. And which one is your favorite flavor. And maybe I'll, I'll give it a try. Because I've only had the lemon one if i'm not mistaken and i really did enjoy it i love iced tea just it's my thing in the summertime it's uh my go-to drink i don't really drink a lot of hot coffee in the summertime but i do drink a lot of like cold beverages like iced teas and iced coffees so two coupons thank you very much sample source you guys are awesome and of course my one dollar coupon for the kind bar which you know, I'm super excited. I know I say this a lot, but I am super stoked 
to get this because I'm definitely going to buy a box of these Kind Bars. And I think $1 off, off the purchase of one nut sea salt. Okay, so I buy it. It's for one bar, so not a box, which is fine because a dollar, I'm not sure how much these are. I think they're like two, three dollars. So if they're like two bucks, I saved myself a dollar. <laughs> thank you very much, Sample Source. You guys are truly amazing. I can't thank you guys enough. You guys are so awesome when it comes to sending people samples to try them before buying them. It is truly a blessing to have you guys in my life because every time when it comes to springtime or the fall time, I am always excited for the next box because you never know what you're going to get in it. And it's just full of surprises and things that you never would have thought of trying, you're able to try it now. So I want to thank everyone at Sample Source for packing me this box. Let's get the box. Let's get the box in the ending, right? You got to have the Sample Source box. I really do appreciate everything Sample Source has done for me. You guys have just helped me try new things that I've never thought I would try them. And I always end up like 90% of the time when I try new samples from Sample Source, I always end up buying them. So it's like that 90% is phenomenal. A 10%, some things I won't ever try again because there's some things I would never buy. But that's, I think that's what Sample Source is all about. They, you, they made this to where you try it before buying it. And if you don't like it, you're not wasting $10 or $5 on something that you don't like. So it truly does help. So I'm going to end the vlog here because this is going to be a very long vlog. It's going to be uh, quite a, an interesting thing to edit. I haven't edited a vlog in so long. So I am so glad. Definitely stay tuned. It's definitely not the last vlog. I'm going to continue doing these vlogs and I can't thank you guys enough for still sticking around. You guys are truly amazing. Thank you very much from me to you all day. I do hope you guys did enjoy today's vlog taste tests on sample source if you guys did show your support give this video a thumbs up and subscribe definitely ring that bell notification so that way when i upload a new vlog you guys get notified instantly the moment that it's released please consider also following me on instagram that's where i'll let you guys know what is coming up next what sort of new products there is out there definitely follow me on instagram if you guys haven't do want to thank you guys very much for watching Definitely, like I always say, share this vlog with your friends and family because your support is truly amazing and you're the reason why I keep doing this. Definitely share this vlog with your friends and family and I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace out.